Hi there, Casey and Jen here with another Fusion video. Today we're going to be talking about creative cueing and we're going to be doing a little bit of pull straps here and I have Jen set up already and underneath her we have a smart spine from our mentor Marie Jose that she's lining her body up on and I have a little non-slip pad here. So she's going to get the center of her body on the long box. Perfect. Now, the next thing I'm going to do is I have another smart spine here. And Jen, I'm going to have you look down and I'm going to lay this onto her spine and even onto the back of her head. So many people drop their head down when they start to do arm work. So this is a wonderful place to cue the back of the head into the smart spine. Does that feel okay, Jen? Mm -hmm. I'm going to have Jen reach for the straps. We have a light spring on. Now, the reason we have her sandwiched in between these two smart spines is because we want to cue the front body and the back body. Usually the clients lose awareness of one side or the other when they're on their tummy, especially that tummy place. So I want Jen to feel like she's trying to traction the smart spine that's underneath her abdominals down towards her feet and she's trying to get the top smart spine to traction up through the crown of her head. So there's a lot of complex cueing here, elongating the front and back of the body. And now, Jen, go ahead and start to move the arms and think about you're trying to traction and slide the smart spine down the pubic bone to the, almost to the tops of the feet. Very good. And then the arms are gonna swing forward. Feel this elongation through the top smart spine. So this is helping her engage her hamstrings because as she's trying to pull the lower smart spine down her body, we want her to feel that elongation all the way through the top of the foot. Very good, Jen. And again, is there any way right from here, Jen, you can usher this, yes, smart spine up, yes, through the crown of her head, much more engagement through the arms. Very strong, Jen. One more time. This is very hard work. And last time, again, find that elongation of that multifidus, which is cueing from the smart spine here. And I'm going to take this off, and Jen, you can go ahead and rest the body down. So that is some very complex cueing with your more advanced clients that you can go into. But then also with your more beginner clients, sometimes it's nice for them to just feel something underneath their belly, especially since you can warm the smart spines, and then a nice warm smart spine on their back. So they really start to understand that we want them to pay attention to the front and back body as they move their arms, because that's typically a very new sensation. Jen, how did that feel moving? That felt intense. Yeah. Yeah, it was, but really connected. Okay, good. All right, we'll experiment with this and we'll see you soon. Take care.